Welcome back, week two out of the course, how you can get your like either consulting client, coaching clients, or just get any, like sign up any big company that wants to pay for your services. And that could be any service that is some sort of knowledge, or you're like a teacher, or you're a coach, or you are someone that has an experience of something. In this week, it's gonna be all about the niche, and like who you're talking to, uh, and with us, we have da -da -da. amazing. Mm. So today there's no whiteboard, but I'm going to use my computer. I'm going to put the questions down here so you can see them, so you can follow and apply these things. And then later, later in like week four ish, you can start to get your clients. And then you can sign them up and like teach them whatever they need to be taught. Maybe you are a musician and you can teach someone to play guitar or, or whatever, or your any knowledge that you have, it doesn't really matter. Mm. So I have a few questions for you. What was great about this week? What was great? What was great about this week and this? exercise with the story oh um i guess that it's engaged it teaches you to write and then you engage in your way the engage okay it's okay great write that down what wasn't great that's the next question what wasn't great you answer that what do you acknowledge yourself for in this week yeah what do you acknowledge yourself for in this week? Answer that one. And the next one, what did you learn about yourself? What did you learn about yourself? Mm. You write that down. And when we are going what in- is today, What is today called? Niche. And when we're going into a space where For example, if you're a mus music musician or if you are a nurse and you have a lot of skill in nursing and you want to sell that skill to someone else, we got to know exactly what it is. So we got to be specific about what type of people we help because it's very easy to go in and start to try to help everyone. Because if we should be really honest to ourselves, like you, has something that I have and I'm a part of you and you are a part of me and you are a part of me and I'm a part of you. So it's very easy to see that, you know what, I want to help the world. And that's what we want to avoid. Um, so for ima imagine that you have a pill. So this is the pill that you have. Okay. And they have a wound. There's something that they it's not okay. And this pill can treat this person. So you have the pill or you are the pill, basically. So if they want to know nurse, they want to learn nursing. Well, you have been working with nursing for 20 years or 15 years, or you haven't at all. You took a class or something happened in your life and you learned something from it you have this thing that people want and that's what we're gonna sell so there is three types of niches that is the most common ones that basically is fundamental to the world it's just what it is we have health we have wealth and we have relationships so basically everyone is some sort of triggered of money it's either healing self, making more money, or improving relationship with either a partner or self. And we have to pick one of these three niches to, if we try to go after all of them, it's gonna be very hard to like, what are you actually doing? So start with picking one. And then the question might be like, what do I pick? Maybe if you're 
mus mus musician that will be teaching someone how to play guitar so they can make money and a living off of it. So that's money, for example. Um, and you have to pick one and you should be passionate about it. So it should be something that you're really like, can't stop thinking about and it just come naturally for you. And this is like part of your life. What's my niche? And what you're doing. Um, what, yeah, what is your niche? You tell me no, 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 this is, you do the work. So exactly, so now she's like, what is my niche? Well, I'm not here to tell you what your niche is. You gotta figure that out, and you gotta make sure that you pick it. Damn, it's windy, isn't it? Then there's a few questions. Do I have personal results? Have I done the work myself? Have I gone the, the, the actual path myself? Number three, what skill do I have in the area, in this niche? Number four, number four, what is special about you? Uh, and the last one has to be answered with a yes. Mm. If, if this is not a yes on this question, then you have to rethink your your niche and what you're doing. And the question is, will people pay for it? Well, to make this simple, we can have a formula, and this formula goes, and this could be written in, in, in really many ways, but I'm gonna say one way, and then later it can be changed. But helping X with Y, to get Q. Helping artists, upcoming artists, to learn guitar and drums to start their own band. Helping women reclaiming their feminine divine core to live in a beautiful state with a perfect partner. Does that make any sense? And here you type your whatever came up for you there. And then we have a few questions and it's like my perfect client and that's to get to know a little bit what, what type of person it is. What are their biggest frustration and challenges? So what are they kind of like it's called pain points. What are they actually want to resolve normally? What do they come with? Is it like, oh, I never found a teacher that could teach me guitar because I, I just didn't understand what they said, or or um, is it this woman that kind of like, you know what, I, I'm I'm completely, I don't feel my body, and I'm out of outside my body, and I never found anyone that could help me feel my feelings. I'm I'm just saying something randomly now, but okay. Um, so what are their pain points, and also what are their hopes, dreams, and desires, pleasures, and goals? Like, what are these things? What's the outcome that they want to achieve? Because every one of us, I, you, and and everyone out there, you there. We always have a dream or an outcome. Even if we don't really think about it, there's always something there. Oh, I just want to be able to play that guitar in front of the fire with some people. Or, you know what, I want to impress that girl so I can kind of like sing for her so I can actually get that relationship that I want. Um, or, yeah, it can be anything. And here you got to find out like what type of, what is their, what's, what is their dreams and what are they dreaming about when they're not talking to anyone because they may be sitting I don't know, sit home and meditate, and they're like, I want to do this, and I want to have this. And, um, and then, what are their biggest fears? And their biggest fears is like, what keeping them up at night? Or what is subconsciously holding them back from reaching this outcome? And what's the thing that stops them to really 
go do the things that they actually want to do. Everyone has fears. No one can bullshit me about that. Like I have, you have, ever you have, all your clients gonna have. And when we know them, it's very easy to speak to them and basically eliminate them if we want to. What makes them happy? It's also good to know. Is it a man or a woman? It's also good to know. Are you mostly working with women or are you mostly working with men? So your clients is exactly where you've been in the past. So your clients is gonna be you and the more you work with them, the more you're gonna be like, shit, this is, man, it's just me, but in another body somewhere else in the world. And the question is also, who do you genuinely wanna help? What's, this is a big thing. I've been doing coaching for many years and, and honestly, I've been taking on clients because they sometimes threw money at me and they're like, hey, Michael, you had, I heard from this, co this client that uh, they ha magic happened and I also want that magic in my life. Where do I pay? Like, let's go. And I kind of like, okay, let's go. You pay here and then it was done. But in the end, when I sat with them, I actually didn't want to work with them. They, for some reason, just wanted to talk to me, but they didn't want to do the work. And those people, honestly, it's not fun. I don't want to do it. It's just like, I've been through that and done with that. Who do you genuinely want to help? Is like, I genuinely want to help someone that actually want to go in and do the work, that actually are after the results and can say like, hey, yeah, you know what? I was wrong about this, but, but now I can see. And then they also take the actions because most people, they don't take action. Even if you talk to them, they won't take action. They just sit there and like, yeah, 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 and then nothing happens. They pay you over and over and they're like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Because they're fearful of something or. We gotta do this in two ways. Normally I only use Facebook, but you also can use a TikTok. You can try that. And getting an account on TikTok and here basically we're gonna go live on Facebook, for example. You can't go live on TikTok in the beginning because it doesn't work. Normally, when people start from zero, they go on and they take like five pro bonos for free. They talk about their business and what they're starting and what they're doing. And then they take five people on to practice. But you can either do that or you can go straight on and basically tell your story and start to take on clients straight away. What do you wanna do? You wanna practice with a few free ones or do you wanna charge them straight away? I think you should charge them straight away. Yeah, you should charge them straight away. So if you're already kinda like, are, are really good at what you're doing, you can just basically sk skip the step of like t doing free. But if you're really new to this and you're watching this and I'm like, I never had a client in my whole life, then the step is going online with on Facebook and going live and talk about the story that you wrote down in the last video. I have a whole thing where basically I can put it in the in the description on YouTube, but it's basically a, a script of how you kind of like go online and you say like, hey, I want to announce uh, this retreat or this what this new business that I'm starting or whatever you want to call it. If you have a retreat or you have a, maybe you have a, like this program and you want to announce the program and you're going to go live and you basically going to say, I'm going to take five people on uh, for free. And I'm going to teach five people how to learn how to play guitar so they can be in a band in within two months time. And I'm looking for five, people that want to learn how to play a guitar and you take them on and it's a whole process we're going to talk about later um, and these people if you're doing it for free the free ones you want to get there like in exchange of them you coaching them is you want their referrals so that you can kind of like have them as you can practice on them basically and it's like an experiment what can I get out of it and they want you want them to speak for you later here i have a like a material i'm we're gonna put it i think we can put it in the description 
but basically is I have a thing where what you can say when you go live it's basically how to press and 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 I'm gonna put it in the description and I want this to be rewritten because I wrote this but maybe it doesn't fit you or it fit you but you can rewrite it it's basically going out to say hey guys you know I remember I said hey guys you know I've been doing this and this and I started the business and I worked in Formula One and I traveled the world and I learned this and I learned this and now I'm taking five people on I'm gonna coach them so they can do the same so blah 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 and then people like and then and then a call to action in the end and then people gonna comment and you start to talk with them and then you ask them do you want to do this thing and they're like yeah we want to do it great and you take them on and you start to it's like a practice thing because the first time you're going to take coach someone it's going to be like oh i never done this before it's like you know it's with everything you do it's always like the first time or when you're it's always practice and then after some time it's going to be like easy to just like you're going to do the same over and over in the end okay so here's the framework of the length of when someone comes in you have to have a framework of how long time you're gonna be working with them and the framework is 12 or 6 months normally sometimes I'd be doing 3 months because honestly I don't know I just feel like 3 months in then I want then I want to kind of like I want to be done with you I want to have someone fresh uh, someone else uh, but if I should be really honest like minimum if someone really needs like if someone really gonna have change in their life I would say six months is like that's what they need to see a massive transformation in some life to be I would say that it should be paid in full they could be a payment plan monthly to monthly if they sign up by their card like a credit card and that could be okay also because then you know it's gonna automatically charge their credit card and they can't like because sometimes if it's not done correctly people will kind of like change their mind and yeah it's, it's a lot of things that can happen uh, I've seen that when people come in the beginning they kind of like signed up and then they're like no and then they would just disappeared after two months for example so you you and also what in the in the commitment of the payment is like where the commitment of doing their inner work is so if they're not really like paying they're also not committed and therefore it's like it's gonna be undone and I know a lot of people gonna say against me about this but like the more they pay the more they pay attention and what I have experienced is that the more they pay the more change they will have but there's so much fear about like oh will they will do they have enough money or like oh now they take their last money so now they really have to like and, it's, and you take you take on their responsibility but the best thing that actually could happen is if they take their last money they have in their pocket and say like fuck this shit I'm gonna make this happen and here's all my money let's go because now I don't give myself a way back most people they kind of like do things half and they're like oh I, I just go in a little bit and then they kind of like they can bail out because it didn't hurt that much but the more they are invested there is no like plan B so you the more they can burn the boat and like really fucking go for it the better it is and it's same for me same for everyone and the sessions six months is 18 sessions 12 months is 36 sessions like make things simple because a confused mind will say no if you're confused you're not gonna have the capacity capacity to say yes if you don't know what you're getting if the client don't know what they get they're gonna like no and they're gonna find out oh, I need to talk to my husband I need to check my bank I need to blah 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 and all of those things it calls objections we're gonna talk about them later but all of those things comes up because they want to be nice to you they don't want to say no in your face because then it will hurt you kind of so people make up I heard 
all of the craziest fucking shit you can ever imagine because people wanted to be nice to me and then they kind of like then they know and then they never see you again like basically they never even like they don't even come near you because if they if they come near you they feel like they kind of like oh then I have to do this because many times they can agree with all of the stuff that they want to do yes I want to reach my dreams and yes I want to do all of this stuff but when it comes to their lower self where the capacity is to make the money if they have money problem they won't let go of the money they just like no these clump of money that I have is that like I'm in survival so I never let go of this this is like life and death to me and if what I'm letting go of too is not better uh, than like anything that could if if it's not really super clear on that that they can progress they won't let go of their money basically also I would say that if you find some Facebook groups you're gonna find some Facebook groups and join that's your niche is about and starting to find these places where you can write your stories later so people can resonate with you yeah so you're gonna start adding people on Facebook and you're gonna start finding these groups and when you when you have people that you have been writing a little bit about you add them or they add you and in the end we want to have people that could see your content I want you to go live in one week's time on a Sunday it's Sunday today actually so next Sunday you want to go live on your Facebook Let's announce your venture your new thing that you're launching this new chapter of your life that you are gonna go for and what are you gonna helping with and and I have a whole I have a whole sheet of what to say I think we can put it there I'm gonna give it to you I think we can put it there of how to write otherwise comment down below and I will kind of like send it out we're gonna t we're going to build hype three days before so if Sunday is the day you go live like three days before you're gonna kind of like write on Facebook like I have such an amazing thing to tell you in a couple of days who wants to know because and, and then it's like why do we do that yeah that's because we want the algorithm to pick people up and the people that actually are interested in like your post is actually vibrating at the same frequency that you do so there are potential people I'm not saying all of them will be but potential people that could be interested in actually working with you and making this thing come true and then we post whatever one time every day and like first day is like oh I have this amazing thing that's going to happen and who wants to know and then like the second day is like I've been working on this blah 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 and you know I mean to blah 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 uh, and now I want to share something with you do you think it like uh, who finds this interesting I'm just saying something now and like the day before it's like this is the last day tomorrow I will go live and I will tell you exactly what's the new thing that I'm doing is anyone interested in personal development or like healing or like making more money or whatever the niche is so it's three days before the Sunday you because then the algorithm start to pick people up on Facebook and then those people are gonna be notified when your life comes on and more people of course also but they're gonna be notified and all of a sudden they're gonna come to your live and they're gonna see your live and the live will stay for 24 hours on Facebook so people can see it 24 hours after in that case it kind of like builds up and people can see it and then later on we will be have a few it's like fishing maybe then we have a few people that we can start to talk about that actually wants your help because that's why we're here we want people that wants our help not that we drag up the mountain we want the people that like you know what Michael I would love for you if you can teach me exactly how you do this thing that would be so fun amazing here also we're gonna start to think about how much we're gonna charge so how much money are you gonna charge I would say starting for really new beginners two thousand dollars for six months 
for a little bit more advanced that has been in this space for a long time, like Miss that sits with me here, I would say you should charge 5,000 for your six months. For 18 sessions? Yeah. And you should charge 8,999 for 12 months. Here, a lot of stuff can come up. Like, oh shit, oh, I, can, I, can I charge that much? And like, do I really, do, I, do people really listen to me? And like, all of this like self-doubt shit might come up here. Be aware of what comes up in this process because here is where the, the real lower self shows up and here is where people cough out. Like, no, I can't charge this, blah, 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 blah. Yes, you can. It's just that you need to do it to overcome that thing. Yeah, I'm, I've been writing down here. Elevate your morning routine, whatever that is. Meditate, whatever you do, do it. See it in your mind. Like, see these people showing up. Like, visualize in your head when you talk to them, when they write to you, who they are, who, they, how, like, how are they looking, what, what are they wearing. Start to, like, see this stuff in your head. What are you doing with them? Who do you, like, how, how do you talk to them? Is it through Zoom or... Or WhatsApp or whatever, whatever, whatever that is. Start to see that and prime yourself for these people to allow them to come into your life, so you can start to transform and impact people all around the world. And I want to say one last thing: when you go live, it needs to be like, I'm the most excited motherfucker on the planet. Like this is crazy. This is gonna change the world. I am fucking, and this would be genius, like you can't like fake, because all, no fake, um, but like really be excited about what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do with the world? Who are you gonna work with? Like, this was really hard for me in the beginning, I guess like, should be really honest, this was, this was super hard because I had all these doubts, like I, oh, can I do it? And like, shit, who would work, wanna work with me? And like, even though I had people like, Michael, your life is amazing. You do all this stuff. How do you do it? Can you teach me? But the lower self comes and then you're like, oh, oh, I don't know. Can I do it? Can I not? So, yeah. If you have questions, comment down below and I will answer them as soon as I can.